I'm, I'm self-employed. Uh, I started my waste business uh, seven years ago when I got uh, made redundant from the steel works where I was there uh, for 35 years. With me, I have a pension. Uh, I get 10000 off the British Steel pension and I earn about 15000 off my waste disposal business. I have, as a result, decided to maintain the 5 PE cut and freeze fuel duty for another 12 months. It's not so bad what they're doing now, uh, like free, freezing the fuel. Uh, at least they haven't they haven't put it up, so it's mm -hmm. costing us more. I mean, I only have the the sort of the one vehicle. I mean, for people who have taxis or like lorry businesses, it'll make it hell of a lot more uh, difference to them. You know, from April the sixth. Employee national insurance will be cut by another 2p from 10% to 8%. And self employed national insurance will be cut from 8% to 6%. Yeah, regarding the national insurance, I don't think it's going to make a big difference uh, to myself. Uh, if they give you this and uh, just carry on taking the payments off you and give you a sort of lump sum at the end of the year. You, you're going to see something. If they, if they were going to give me £400 at the end of the year, it's a bit of a bonus for me. So I believe that the yearly would be 450 for myself, but also for my wife, it would be exactly the same. Um, and in relation to what the previous budget, that will sort of be um, 900 each essentially over the uh, the 12 over 12 months it just gives us a little bit of breathing space we uh, renewed our mortgage um in december and obviously it increased from our previous because of obviously with inflation rising we did manage to work it out our finances but it just gives us a little bit of breathing room if we fancy saving up for something else if it's any work on the house a holiday that sort of thing at, at the moment I'm probably not going to vote because I, I just can't see any point in voting. If they give me some incentives to vote on certain things, like like you said, fuel, uh, gas, electric, let like let the let the working class people see see something out of it, you know, and, and make make them even people who aren't working, give them a bit more money so they can have a better life. I did vote Conservative in the last uh, general election, and I probably will again. But I do have a bit of trepidation if this budget is purely with a general election in mind and not the future. It does seem as though the Chancellor has been aiming towards people who go to work to try and give them a bit more relief in relation to the national insurance being dropped twice. So I think with those, with what's happened with that, it definitely does make me um, more than likely vote Tory again.